WABJ sports reporter Aaron Fort joins us with the complete wrap-up. Well, guys, the Capitals had us all on the edge of our seats as they made a run for it this season. Even though the Caps ended the season with a heartbreaking 6-2 loss to the Pittsburgh Penguins in Game 7 of the Eastern Conference Sitting Finals, they still managed to win more than a few DC fans with some of the best hockey playing seen in years. On the hardwood, after a painful season, finishing second to last in the league with a 19-63 record, the Wizards have already started making plans for next season. They signed Flip Saunders as head coach. Saunders agreed to a four-year $18 million contract. Um, I look forward to the opportunity. Mr. Pollen didn't put any pressure on me when we just met. He said, just don't let us down. So uh, that's, that's no pressure at all. But uh, Withers training camp kicks off at VCU September 18th. Turning to the NFL. In the recent draft, the Redskins picked up six new players, including Brian Arakpo from the University of Texas. But the player everyone is talking about is Skins' $100 million man, Albert Hainsworth. Hainsworth agreed to a seven-year deal that could potentially max out to $115 million. Switching gears, heavy on the mind of high school athletes this time of year, is getting recruited to play on the college level. I talked with a couple of coaches and players recently about how the web is helping them find each other. You guys play lacrosse, right? Yes. And um, how did you, did you get recruited here? Yes. Yes. Both of you did? Yes. Okay. And um, how did you go about getting recruited? Um, you go to summer tournaments and you email coaches to let them know what field you're going to be playing on and at what time. Oh, so y'all didn't use any websites or anything like that? No. Pretty much you just find a school that you're interested in and you email the coach and then you let her know where you're going to be and then she can come see you. You coach girls lacrosse, right? Yes. I coach and girls lacrosse and I've been at Holy Cross for, this is my eighth season. Okay. Now, um, did you recruit, you recruit all your players directly? Yes, we see them as early as sophomores in high school, and we recruit them throughout their two to three years of high school play. Now, how do you choose the players you want to pick? Um, we see them in various tournaments, or they send us information on them, which gives us you know, an opportunity to go see high school games, and we kind of judge their talent based off of the, especially summer tournaments and, and high school games. Posting your profile online can be more than just a quick way to find a date. Good luck to these guys and girls. That's all for sports.